going to be talking about how our feline friends have superior eyes compared to our backwards ones. First, we're going to start off by explaining the anatomy of the human eye. The human eye is surrounded by a connective tissue called the sclera. The choroid is a thin vascular layer between the sclera and retina that contains blood vessels and nerves. The photoreceptors that are specialized sensory cells that respond to light are contained in the retina. The information that is received by these is sent through the inner neurons to the optic nerve which sends the information to the brain for processing. On the front of the eye, there is the cornea, which is a clear dome that allows light to enter. In between the cornea and the iris lies the anterior chamber, which is a fluid-filled chamber containing aqueous humor. The iris is a circular colored area that controls the amount of light that enters the eye by adjusting the size of the pupil, the black area in the middle of the iris. The light is focused on the retina by the lens using ciliary muscles. When they contract, the lens thickens, causing the lens to have a rounder shape, allowing the eye to focus on nearby objects. If the lens relaxes, the lens flattens, focusing on objects in the distance. Have you ever wondered why cat's eyes are so different than ours? Why do they glow in the dark? Why do they see much better in the dark? Why are their pupils slit-like? Cats have a tapetum lucidum behind their retina, a special adaption that allows them to see more efficiently in lower lighting. When the light enters the eye, it is absorbed by the rods and cones on the retina, but not all of the light is absorbed. In human eyes, there is a dark pigment behind the retina that destroys this light, but in cats, the tapetum lucidum reflects the light back onto the retina, enabling them to take in more light. This contributes to their superior night vision and causes the glow in their eyes. The retina has two types of photoreceptors, rods and cones. Cones are designed for visual acuity, speed, distance, colors, and binocular vision. Rods are responsible for absorbing dim light. Since cats have a higher ratio of rods, they can see six times better in dim light than us. Also, cats' eyes are proportionally bigger compared to their heads, unlike human eyes, and this allows them to take in more light when there is not a lot available. Since the sphincter muscles on the iris interlace, the cats have a slit-like pupil. This allows the pupil to almost completely constrict, protecting the retina from damage from bright light. Also, the pupils are capable of dilating more than a human's, which allows them to let in more light, enhancing their night vision. the cat's meow. I hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. Please join us next week where we talk about the cat's superior muscles, strength, and agility.